Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, and symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show we're nearing the end of days. Well, there was this terrible killing in Texas at a Walmart where a family was in a car and a man drove up in a red truck and a red hoodie and just started shooting and killed a seven-year-old girl and then has run off. They still have not found the suspect. This is the girl that was killed. May God have mercy upon her soul and her family is this terror. On our channel we've been tracking for many years and showing how all of the world is as a matrix going right by the Bible. We show the spiritual side. The police will handle the human killer. They will catch him. May God willing that they catch him. We show the dark side of the Satan character that causes most of these murders. Even all the way back to the Aurora shooting in 2012 and all the way back to the Columbine shooting. See this Illuminati card right here? We track the spirit of the pyramid here. Satan. The fallen angels. That's what the pyramid represented. The fallen angels. All the way back to Egypt. See this clown looking character? Your Abaddon, your Satan coming down as a spirit going into host different bodies to kill. That's why this is on our dollar bill. It's considered the builders. That's Satan's eye right there. Just as right here, so he's on the top of the pyramid. Gets you M-A-D and keeps you distracted. Everyone's mad now. See how everyone's mad about this girl being killed? They're hunting, they're looking, there's terror. And it's, that's the way this thing works. It's not a small thing. It's happening around the world. We've shown this all around. The shadow army of Satan. The beast out of the sea. Especially after the children. Just like in the twelfth month. The dragon is after the woman and the children. The dragon was wroth with the woman and went to make war with the remnant of her seed which keep the commandments of God and have the testimony of Jesus Christ. We are at war. Our side may not know it. You, me, and most of humanity may not realize it, but Satan is at war with us. He's using the government. He controls most of the world. He brings terror and pain and tears the family apart. There it is. War against Jesus Christ's seed. Well, on our channel, we actually map these things out. This killing is going to catch a suspect from a long time ago we're going to catch the shadow yea though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death I shall fear no evil so he's right on top of the pyramid on your dollar bill well this is where the killing happened North Shore this is the Walmart right about here Houston Texas this is the Walmart. This is the address where the killing happened. We're actually going to show this beast. The whole world is mapped out this way. The fallen angels and the arch angels, the, the fallen architects, have been doing mostly all of this. Designing the world for pain. Right here we're going to see a dragon. And then we are going to see the beast working with the dragon and feeding this thing that looks like a Eucharist. It's talked of in the Bible. It's called a stumbling block to cause people to eat things sacrificed unto idols and then to commit adultery. One thing to be skeptical, but watch and you'll see it's all there. 
See the pyramid? The burdens of Egypt? See them feeding this thing to this man? See the dragon? First thing is notice that it's all there. Right by the lines. See him feeding that thing? Just like a Eucharist. It's in the food all around the world. It's called a stumbling block. Behold, I have a few things against thee, will that, because thou hast there them that hold the doctrine of Balaam, Satan, who taught Balak to cast a stumbling block before the children of Israel, to make war with the remnant of her seed. The dragon was wroth with the woman and went to make war with the remnant of her seed, casting this stumbling block everywhere. It's in the food around the world. Cast a stumbling block before the children of Israel to eat things sacrificed unto idols. In the middle of the night, most of the food guys and the big groups of witches, if you will, do this. Just like when the Catholic Church does the Eucharist. We've already shown the Catholic Church is part of this also and to commit fornication. The Nicolaitans, the thing that I hate. So you can see that. That's called the stumbling block. It's actually in the book of Daniel of Satan doing that. It's all around the world. Stum fornication, masturbation, porn, uh, all of that. There he is. See him feeding that thing to him? And the burdens of Egypt, the pyramid? That's right where she was killed. That's the guy was under this guy's control. How do we know that? Because today we, we have a huge, huge, huge connection all the way back to here and to the Illuminati. That guy is on this card. That guy. Over 10 years ago almost we mapped this out and now we finally caught this guy. He's on this card. This card right here showing about a murder coming. And do you see how this thing's tied around this man's neck? That's because it has a lot to do with the, the devil tricking them. See, just like masturbation. Nothing against you and your masturbation, but this guy's against it. He's using it. I'm not here to tell you yes or no. This guy gets people into a rage. See how he's hooked on that, ready to hang himself? The same picture of this is right there. And this picture was connected to a lot of murders. When this man killed many people in this theater. See how it looks just like that theater? On the date. Why 720 on that date? Because it comes back to when the eagle landed on the moon. On the 20th of July. And the woman were given two wings of a great eagle that she might fly into the wilderness. They're trying to stop that eagle and kill the woman. Satan. He's on this card. Can you see this guy right here in the shadows yet? And do you see how they work with the pyramid? This is connected all the way to the large CERN Hadron Collider. Head on collider. Getting into people's heads. There he is. You see the shadow guy going in through the eyes? See how it farms murder, mayhem, and terror all day? Millions and billions of these fallen angels. There he is. Look at that. Is that amazing or what? Thank you, Lord God. There he is. That's what killed this little girl. That's what got inside this guy's head. Whatever it is, you could go to the fast food store. And it might just be the french fries you're eating. That's This thing controls the world. That's what's talked of in the Bible. That's what Jesus told us. This guy runs every planet. Every president. Obama or Trump. They have to be connected to him. The Pope. They're connected to him. It's in the Bible, guys. That every single world leader will fight Jesus. 
and the kings of the earth, every king, and the great men, well, we have a president right now running around saying make everything great, and the rich men, and the chief captains, and the mighty men, and every bondman, and every free man, hid themselves in the dens and the rocks of the mountains, and said to the mountains and the rocks, Fall on us, and hide us from him that sitteth on the throne, and from the wrath of the Lamb. For the great day of his wrath is come, and who shall be able to stand? Why is Jesus going to have so much wrath? Boom. That's why. Think, think real clearly now. Do we really think that God is going to leave this imagery here for the millennium of Christ and for the forever kingdom? Or isn't it reasonable to think that God is going to hit this earth so hard that these images are going to be wiped out? He's not going to let this image sit here forever. He's going to hit this earth so hard that this is all gone. This is all governments. This is your Obama or your Donald Trump. Whoever you vote for, it's just part of the system. Keep hope in the promise of Jesus and the world to come. This world is meant to be wiped out. And now you see why. That that's your Catholic Church, your Islam Church, everything. All of them. All going against Jesus. And, and yes, in the Catholic Church, your Mary worship takes away worship from Jesus. There that guy is. What a great connection. I'm sad for this family. There it all is. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. We have an actual president now that talks about making things great. The great men. What Jesus says he's coming to destroy all of them. And most of the planet. And now we know why. Look at it. God have mercy on us all. Keep faith. All the way back to the Aurora shooting. God have mercy on us all. See the pyramid? The burdens of Egypt. God have mercy.